And this morning, we are learning more about a first-of-its-kind venue that's being proposed right now in the South Bay. An investment group is looking to transform Chula Vista's Bayfront with plans to build a multi-billion dollar major league soccer stadium and sports complex. CBS 8's Chris Grove live at Chula Vista Bayfront with some new details. You're learning some uh, new information on this proposal here, Chris. Yeah, good morning, guys. And look, it's only natural that when citizens of really any city or county, but especially here in San Diego County, hear about a stadium being built, they're, they're worried first about whether or not public dollars will be used. Well, what's unique about this investment group that is finally now coming forward with their details is that this is a private uh, investment group. This is private money. So they're raising money. They're raising capital here. This is plans to build a $2.5 billion, not just a stadium, but an entire complex. Now, the stadium itself could have as many as 50,000 seats. That's why this is being billed as potentially the largest MLS stadium in the country, though that MLS deal we'll get to a little bit more is not exactly set in cement, if you will. Now, the name of this group is Petra Developments, and their proposal, along with that stadium, would have also built in hotels, an athletic training center, youth league practice fields, restaurant shops, and much more. Now, a couple of things. Now, they still would have to purchase that land that they're ideal identifying, uh, which of course is just right over our shoulder over by where the uh, the Gaylord Hotel as well as the old power plant used to be. They still need to acquire that land. They also still need to figure out whether or not MLS will indeed be choosing San Diego San Diego for their 30th uh, expansion team over a town like Las Vegas. But in the meantime, people all around Chula Vista seem to be pretty excited about this latest news. I think it's a good idea. The, the sports are good for, for the young, for the young people. A lot of fans from Tijuana that we can come to uh, watch a very good uh, a soccer. Game. Now, according to the Union Tribune, they did hear from Major League Soccer, and they said that while they are looking at San Diego uh, about potentially having that 30th team, they have not had any discussions with any group about a Chula Vista stadium. Now, as far as the investment group, they said that while MLS is their first choice, it would not be their only option. So potentially trying to attract either a different type of team or potentially even another type of sport. But as we know, soccer is huge throughout San Diego County and would certainly get a lot of people excited if this could be the home of the newest MLS franchise. Eric Anetta, 